Hey, 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 good morning. It is time for 7 Minutes in the Morning. My name is Tom Rigsby, your host. i go here where the camera is, or maybe move the camera to where I am. How about that? How y'all doing this morning? Did you have a good Labor Day yesterday? If you're here in the States, if you are out and about and abroad, eh, not so much. Sorry about that. A um, little bit of a holiday yesterday. I actually did something for you yesterday. If you were watching the channel, you saw a uh, behind-the-scenes live broadcast that I promised I would take down this morning, and it's gone. So, if you missed it, sorry. That's uh, that's one of those things. I will say that um, we'll talk a little bit about Patreon at the end, but that's something that will probably show up on that feed, eh, just so you can see it. Hang on to it. Hey, if uh, you, when you get here, if you would just say hi, leave me a comment, thumbs up, you got funny hair, whatever, I don't care what it says, just let me know that you're here. Whether you're watching live or on the replay, doesn't matter. This week, we are talking about work that matters. One of the uh, kind of key foundational pillars uh, of the work that I do and what I teach, so just good stuff coming this week. Yesterday was kind of an introduction to work that matters. It kind of worked out that it was on Labor Day, huh? How about that? Almost like I planned it that way. Today I want to talk about work that matters to whom. <coughs> Excuse me. That is a sure sign I need more coffee. <clears throat> All right, so when we talk about work that matters, who should it matter to? Should it matter to me? Isn't that selfish? Should it matter to somebody else? What do I get out of that? That's what I want to talk about today. So, easy answer, the simple answer. Uh, I shared this a little bit yesterday. Work that matters is work that moves you toward your goal by creating value in the world. That's it. Not, not any more complicated than that. And so with that definition, we get both. Right? It moves me toward my goal. Right? So that's... it's. It's giving me feedback, it's feeding me, and it's creating value in the world. And that's for other people. So work that matters, matters to more than just you, more than somebody else. It has to matter to at least two people. So I, my homework for you yesterday was to think about, does the work that you do move you toward your goal? Right? Does it matter? And I, I talked yesterday about the bucket of water theory. I used to use this uh, example all the time. You take a bucket of water, you fill it up, you jam your hand down in it, leave it there for a couple of seconds, yank it out really fast. The size of the hole that's left is how much you'll matter when you're gone, right? But I do believe that we have an opportunity to make a difference far beyond our presence. And I'm not just talking about after we're dead. In a role, at, at a job, in a role with a business, all those things. We can create a long-lasting, long-living impact if we focus on creating value for other people. Right? So think about, so now yesterday I asked you to think about, does, your, does the work that you do, does your job move you toward your goal? Now does, I want you to think about, does it create value for other people? And, and come up with some names, right? Don't just say, eh, yeah, I, I guess it does. Think of some specific names in individual people, and for that person, how does your work today create value for them? Right? Because when we think about the impact that we have one-on-one, -on -one, like, and I've said this before, and I, I'll keep my politics soapbox over there in the corner but as a culture as a society we suck now at being able to disagree with each other I mean if you go back a couple of hundred years our, our whole the, the way the country was founded was predicated on the idea that we had different people with different ideas and they talked about them and compromised now we can't even talk about them because we anonymize the impact, right? When we say, you people, or they, 
or somebody, right? We're anonymizing the other party. So what I want you to do today is unanonymize, disanonymize. Don't make anonymous who it is you're creating value for. If you want to, grab a piece of paper, an index card, make a list. Jot down five names and how you create value for them. It might be harder than you think when you start thinking about it. And now here's some bonus if you want bonus points for your homework. Reach out, contact those people today. Hey John, how you doing? I hope that something we're doing brightens your day. That's all. Doesn't have to be any more complicated than that. Quick text message, email, speak to them if they come in. Just, hey, I hope something we're doing is helping you out. I'm telling you, you'll be amazed at the results. I promise. Just try it. Five people, that's all it takes. Five people. All right? All right, so yesterday, does your job move you toward your goal? Does your work move you toward your goal? Today, does it create value? All of this is about we're working toward this work that matters conversation. And uh, over the next three days, we're going to talk about four things. I still haven't figured out how we're going to do that. Um, but but we'll, we'll get it worked in there somehow to figure out uh, where, if the answer to either one of those questions is no, the next couple of days we're going to talk about how to fix that, how to change that. So you want to be sure and tune in for that. Also, if you know somebody that can benefit from this conversation, tag them in a comment down there. Just put their name, at and their name, and uh, let them know. They will appreciate it also. Okay, I promised I'd talk about Patreon just a little bit. I have set up a Patreon page where you can support the work that's going on here. Um, yeah, there's a link to it in the show notes down there. I almost forgot where I put the link. There's a link in the, uh, in the notes. If it's not showing up on Facebook, give it about 30 seconds after the show is over with. It'll show up there. Uh, a link where you can go in for um, just uh, much less than a dollar a day. <laughs> you can help out what I'm doing here, cover some of the cost of putting this, uh, putting this show on every morning. I would appreciate it. The other people that gain value from it would as well. All right, that's it for today. Today is Tuesday. It's Talk Radio for Entrepreneurs. Today is a pre-recorded episode with my friend Dan Green. Uh, he has since moved to Charlotte. We got one more episode in before he hit the road. Be sure and tune in and listen to that. Uh, you can find that on talkradioforentrepreneurs.com or live on the air, wtkiradio.com. Tomorrow will be Wednesday, coffee shop show tomorrow. But before that, this show right here, seven minutes in the morning. Don't miss it. I'll be back here then, and I'll talk to you then. You have a great Tuesday.